That's why sometimes it's a very big curse to do what I do. Because being, like, more organized, there's never a too organized with IT. Like, there is only ever just enough. It's kind of, well, I think there's a lot of professions that are that way. Yeah. Um, cause... What did you do with your pile? What? I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to put this pile of... I don't I know. split it because um, there's ripples on this water and then there's straight water and then more yellow. This is my ship I, just, have. Okay. I don't know what this is, but I How's have it? the is yellow going. Oh, I didn't paint my nails today. Oh no. Yeah, it's ruined. Let's start over. Oh, it's the color of the aisles. Yeah, they're just like a They're cream color. Nail color. Zoom that's not nail color. That's... No, that's nail color. Well, it's just stained. Yeah. So you that's just stained. what my nail color is. So I only have three you of have the nail. Can I have that nail file? I've been filing my nails all week because I haven't done it in like two weeks and they were getting fucking long. And um, so I've been shaping them all week because it's like, you know, whenever you cut your hair and you there's a piece off, mm -hmm. so you just kind of file them down a little bit at a time until they feel comfortable again. Yes. And they're finally to a length that they don't bother me, although this thumbnail feels really long even though it's not. I know it's not. It doesn't look like it, but it feels longer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about that, I was like, oh god, this spell is going to be ten times harder, then we're going to be upset because... Nope, I'm not spiraling. We're not allowed to spiral. I already did like six spirals this morning, so. Same. But we're not spiraling. We're going to do this because it's fun. Because we like doing puzzles. And you say it like that. <laughs> I know, it sounds really awful when I say it like that. <laughs> sounds like But we really like, do enjoy doing puzzles. puzzles. Like, stood down, doing a puzzle. We really do enjoy puzzles. doing puzzles, guys. I, I promise we do. We just have a lot of anxiety. Yes. The aforementioned anxiety. Yes. Yeah, that. See? I don't even know if I'm on camera because I'm so. You're on the table, you're on the camera. Oh, good. Because I'm like. Kind of. And left your way over there. The edge. Living on the edge. I keep looking up the video and I'm like, that's not how I set those colors. And I'm like, that's because the TV's bad. Uh, it's not. It's just so, it's just because whenever I set the colors, I put them on my monitor, which just has a better quality than a TV ever will. Unless you spend a shit ton of money. When I, I did see at Walmart, there was a monitor that was 24 inch for that's $200. How big those are. And I was like, I wonder if that would be better. Because it was only $199, I thought, well, that's... That's a lot. It's actually quite a lot. I paid 130 for that one. Yeah, but that's for a TV, TV, and that's 32 Yeah, but if you need a those, monitor and not a TV... Are, but see the size difference? Right. That's a 24-inch one. Right. If, so the TV's bigger. Yeah, obviously. But um, it, by a lot, is what yeah. I'm saying. So, like, the text would be smaller. Stuff. The TV's fine. It does what it's supposed to do. It, it's just blurry. It just displays. It's not blurry. That's the, that's the reason why we replaced this because the last one was blurry. Yes. And you, did, I couldn't you didn't like, like it at all. Which is funny because you don't look at it. I do look at it sometimes. Not as much. Yeah, but, I spend a lot of time. Yeah, I not as much not, as you. It is a handy tool though. Like sometimes I'll look up and be like, oh, that's <laughs> not how the puzzle should go. Okay. It's definitely a tool I would recommend if you're puzzling. Yes. Because it's Most. it's like in painting, like the the best advice I ever got for any kind of art form is take a step back. Yes. If you're struggling or like you're stuck in something, just take a step back and look at it, or even like use your phone to look at it. Mm -hmm. I think you got that from Penis Palette. Um, oh yeah. I nice. think that's where we got that tip because their whole thing is like chillax. You're just fucking. <sighs> The world won't end if you don't complete this painting the way it's supposed to be done. I will say you were right in the first time that we went to Pino's Palette. Because... Sam says we have to hydrate. I'm hydrating with coffee. Uh-oh. I don't have my water. I'm hydrating with coffee. Yeah, we added hydrate. 
Because whatever. Thank you. And this counts because there's this was made with mostly water, which is really dirty. Hydration is relative, right? Well, the thing is, is like a lot it's of people. Relative. So th there's a really good discourse about this online, <laughs> actually, because a lot of people are like, if you're not hydrating with water, you're doing it wrong. But some people can't bring themselves to drink water, so just put some liquid. Because any amount of liquid is better than none. Right. So, like, if all you can do is hydrate yourself with fucking pop, then then do it. Strive to be better. Strive to do better if you I'm can. I'm not going to say hydrate with But, that. like, but I'm just saying, That's like, junk. if you... That's not hydrating, yeah. But I'm just saying, if you can't bring yourself to drink water or tea or something, start somewhere that you can do. And then try to work Flavor. into a place. I mean, but I'm yeah. like, if, if you just crucify people who only drink I'm pop. Crucifying. I mean, you just said you, they're doing it wrong. They're not. No, hydrated. I said you should. If the only liquid they're, they're getting. I mean, you just said they're doing it wrong because you nope. said they shouldn't. <laughs> I said they should. If all they can is drink pop, then they should drink pop because it's actually hydration. And then try to work in something that's lesser. Like, whenever I quit pop, I didn't quit like whole turkey I uh, the first time. And the second time, I switched to another sugar substitute um, because the biggest thing with pop is caffeine and sugar, right? For right. me, because that's the pop I drink, caffeine and sugar. So I switched to um, Crystal Light, which had caffeine in it. All right. So I was substituting, I was doing like 50-50 pop and, and Crystal Light, and then slowly I was just drinking like Crystal Light, and then I started drinking juice because my body's like, it's basically the same thing, <laughs> even though it didn't have any caffeine in it. And I would just like water down the crystal light until it was basically just water. That's what and I'm that's, saying. That's how yes. I quit the first two times. But I'm just saying, if if you are in a place mentally where you cannot bring yourself to drink anything and pop, then drink the pop. It's okay. It's better to drink the pop than to sit around dehydrated all day. But pop dehydrates you. So but it ha instead of sugar still... coating what needs to be done, I'm not sugar. I'm not sugar fruit. coating. If you all are. you can bring yourself to do is drink pop, then drink the damn pop. Because it is better to have some liquid in your body than to have no liquid in your body. And you shouldn't tell people that if you're only drinking pop, then you're wrong. Because some people don't have, like, that control. You know, some people are in a depressive state where the only thing that makes them slightly happy with being alive is to drink pop. So you should not tell them the way they, they're existing is wrong. No, I was just telling the truth, but that's okay. The truth is, it's their fucking body. They can do whatever the fuck exactly. they want. They want to fill it with pop. It has not your job exactly. to tell them they're living their life wrong. I didn't say they were living their life wrong. And you literally I'm just saying it. you can hydrate better with water than, or something of water than with pop that's sugar and caffeine and loaded with crap. Because you know all the science facts on it. Uh, it's just, you can look it up, I mean, if you'd like, but. The first ingredient in pop is water. Yeah. I'm not saying it's the best tool for hydration, but some water actually doesn't isn't good at hydrating. That's why they, that a lot of sports people drink sports drinks because whenever you're in a place like um, Death Valley, when we're in Nevada, or I guess it's technically California, it feels like Nevada because the, the scenery doesn't change from the Nevada border to California. Um, they actually recommend that you drink uh, Gatorade. Because you need the like sodium to help you, uh, you're you're dehydrating so fast in Death Valley that just drinking water you can never drink enough to stay hydrated. Mm -hmm. So even as you're drinking water, you're dehydrating yourself. Right. So you actually have to drink something with like a sugar and like sodium content so that you can retain the water that you're actually drinking. Because otherwise you'll sweat it out so fast that you won't even notice. Hmm. Like that's how people die in Death Valley is because they're like, oh, I have a gallon of water, I'll be fine. But as they're drinking it, they're dehydrating, or they're sweating and, like, losing water faster right. than they can possibly drink the water. So actually, in that situation, water is not the best way to hydrate. <laughs> Something with a higher sugar content and sodium content is the best way to hydrate. Interesting. And that's on science. Luckily, we don't live there. We live in a place that has, like, 50% humidity all the time. <laughs> that's not true. I don't know what the humidity is. I think it's, like, 30 right now. You know what's nice about Magic Puzzle Company puzzles? What? Is the pieces go together really well. Yes, but you can't pick them up. 
Yeah, it's not like Holly Garden where they're locked in place and they're never falling apart again, but it's got that satisfying push in like yeah. Holly Garden's does. Okay. Also, very matte, which is very appreciated. Yes, matte is definitely appreciated. Should work on blue. I'm working on nothing. I'm waiting okay. for you to do the edge because um, you have edge. Why? Why would I do it all? Um, because you're my mom. Oh. Does that mean I have to I'm actually it? working on the pink tubies. I just but... talked to your sister about this because uh -oh. yes, I'm I'm the mom. Y'all's mom. What? News but news flash. I don't have to find everything for everybody because I can only find it for you guys. So what? she's gonna have to start finding things for her family. <laughs> yeah, you're not their mom. <laughs> right. So it's not infinite. She was like, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. I didn't agree to this. You did, actually. You signed a contract when yep. you had birthed a child. When you birthed a as child. As soon as you signed that birth you... certificate, you decided to become a mom. I don't know what you thought that was. That was a contract. <laughs> Becoming a mother. That means you have to find all things at all times. It's in our mother contract, sorry. It's... Why do you think I was like, nah, I'm good? <laughs> Taking care of another human? I can't even take care of this human. That's safe, but, you know. And you get to get blamed for everything that's wrong yep. with that human yeah, for this the rest is of your life. Your future, Sam. 30 years. Yep. I don't think those two pink ones. Thank you, man. Thank you, man. This puzzle is kind of creepy though. I don't know why, but I really vibe with this puzzle. <laughs> I think it's because it's a bunch of little puzzles together. Yeah, and that's kind of why I picked it too, because I was like, worst case scenario, we put together each little island and then just kind of piece it together. Yeah. Which I think the last time we got together, we got together. We get done so quick, we were like, what just happened? Yeah, it was kind of <laughs> weird. I don't think that'll happen today because I'm so no, fucking tired. I'm but... tired too. <clears throat> Seems. Also, we hyped up. I feel like we overhype a puzzle because we're like, that was fun. Let's do that again. And then we don't. And then, like, next time we're like, we hyped this up so much. It's got to be the best puzzle in the world. And then we do it again. And we're like, I mean, it's not, but it's a good puzzle. <laughs> I think it's because we do it after a really hard puzzle. So yeah. We think yeah. That it's easy, but it's, it's not easy. It's just easier than the what? world's hardest puzzle in the history of <laughs> the time yeah before. yeah maybe let's just stop doing hard puzzles uh never gonna happen yeah i think that's kind never. of our thing now and never. that's the problem never. because i think that's what we're just doing now. it's just the images that we like is they're hard ones yeah so agreed i think that's also why it always sounds like we hate puzzling i don't hate puzzling i really do enjoy it See? but I think I, me getting on to myself, it's just me loving myself. Uh, and that's wrong, actually. No, it's, it's, it's all you me. You should be a lot nicer to yourself. Yeah. That's overrated. <laughs> Childhood drama. <laughs> it's not. It's just overrated. Sometimes you yes. just Self need Self-love. To... Overrated. Go and hate yourself. No, sometimes you just need to whip yourself into shape and say, okay, no more. And just, you yeah. Know. How often does that no work more. for you? Always. Oh, you just say, I, I no you're, more. You're done being sad? Yep. Huh? You That's have a good cry and you move on and it's all good. It's yeah, suppress, deny. No, you have Contain. a good cry and you move on and it's all good. That was really loud. I did that on purpose. <laughs> so stop speaking bullshit. <laughs> I thought that's what we were doing today. Speaking bullshit? Uh-huh. No, I mean, ah. that's what you're doing today. So, yeah, though. <laughs> that was really good. That was good. That was like, <clears throat> quick. Black. Good job. Oh, there's the pink ones. 
do, 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 do. That's what penguins say. Oh? That's how they sound. I'm pretty sure they don't. Yep. Do, 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 do. They still talk. Oh, yeah, they do. Are you crazy? Eric's talk, but they're exceptional. They talk? It's just not our language. We just don't understand it, but they do talk. Have you seen that TikTok of the lady, like, doing face faces to, like, birds uh -oh. talking to each other? There there were some birds outside her house, I guess, that were, like, squawking at each other. Yeah. So she did, like, faces, like, they were giving each other attitude. It was hilarious. <laughs> yes. My For You page last night was filled with the wreck on, in Colorado. Have you seen that one? Where it was like four perspectives of the same wreck. Because the oh. lady, like, I guess, from what I can tell, she sideswiped somebody. Like, she was going through a red light or something. She sideswiped somebody and then, like, ran into the front of a truck. Yeah. Like, oh. I, don't, I don't know what she was doing. But it looks like she hit a car because there was a lady in a car. And, like, she, w she got out of her car, which was, like, it hit the front of a truck. Yeah. And then she ran off. And she ran off. And like a, a person on the side was like, "Hey, lady, do you need a ride?" And she turned around, like, "You read it?" She's like, "No, who are you? Why are you running away?" <laughs> and she just like turned and bolted. But there's like a perspective from somebody that lived in like an apartment on the street. Yeah. So there's somebody like with the the perspective of like they're filming it from outside outside their window, oh and then there's somebody on the street filming it, and then there's somebody in the wreck filming it, <laughs> and it's just like there's like four perspectives That's of the same cool, wreck. Though. I, that, I mean, that. that's that's how the world is now. But yeah, it was interesting. Oh, I, I was like, why am I seeing this wreck so many times? <laughs> that would be interesting to see it from the different perspectives. Yeah, it was it was weird because it's like you're in a movie or something. Because you know how like movies can pers yeah. shift perspective, but like that's well, not how real life is. Yeah, it was just funny. It's also good because you got to see better angles and oh, there you know, of this crazy wreck that she had. I just don't know why she ran. I mean, I do, because she was at fault. But yeah. by a lot. She was very at fault. Just like the audacity to be like, hmm, fuck that up. I'm good. Like, they're gonna, they're gonna know it was you, because I hope you didn't steal that car. Like, Oh, true. You know, like, unless that car's stolen, they're gonna just run the plates and know that it's your car. Like... <laughs> I'm pretty sure the AC must have been off, because now it's cold in here. Oh, it feels wonderful. Maybe I'm just, like, sitting now. I should have given it off. I just give it off. I have soft. I'm just not a soft person. Like, outside the house, soft person. Yeah. I, I wear socks. Like, I'll walk outside in just socks. Like, to go to the mailbox or something. Right. It does not bother me. Inside, when I'm at home, just chilling, hate socks. Really? Like, well, no, that's not even true. As soon as I go to bed, like, if I'm climbing into bed, like, I'll be there and I'll be like, I fucking have socks on. I have to, like, rip yes. them off. Like, yeah, I, cannot, I agree. I cannot. I can't Even have though, socks like, on Even though, like, my feet are always cold. I'm under the blankets? No. I don't. Ugh. I don't want socks. But. Socks are icky. As soon as I'm, like, trying to go to sleep. How do you But work? not if I sleep on the couch, because I fell asleep last night on the couch. Yeah. Watching TV instead of doing what I was supposed to be doing. That pile right there, I have it. Yes, thank you. Yeah. You should have pride in your work. I don't. Fuck them. Mm -hmm. Got an email at 5 o'clock yesterday. 5.15, because it was almost... Well, I guess it was like... I don't know. I don't know what time it was, but I was driving home. <laughs> and I pulled up to the last stoplight before I got to the house, and I had an email from my boss like, Hey, can you have this done in a week? Nope. Okay. Fuck off. <laughs> like, it's right at 5 o'clock. Stop emailing. And then I got another one from 8 that I haven't read yet. It's fuck off. <laughs> like, why are you waiting until 5 o'clock to send me email? I haven't heard from this man all day. I haven't heard from him all day. I don't day. understand. So, yes, that's when people are trying to but, get their stuff done. We saw after getting the yeah, brace, nice. or after JD, like... Taking out the dog, you know, whereas in him walking her outside so she doesn't like walk down steps and stuff. Right. We saw significant improvements within a day. Oh, nice. Yeah. It's like, wow. If 
he could have just said, been like, maybe try rest for a couple weeks. Instead of instantly saying Did surgery. you tell the story of the vet? I don't think I have. I don't know. Um, so we took our, so our dog started limping a couple weeks ago. Yeah, it was a couple weeks. That we took I actually it. saw it on camera because I went back okay. to look like, did I look at her leg the minute and it was, we had the window open that day. Yes. So it definitely, we would have heard it. Cause here's the thing. We took our dog to the vet cause she was limping. And the vet says she has ruptured, not just tore her ACL. It's called a CCL, but Without. essentially her ACL. He wiggled her knee around and was like, yeah, it's definitely, definitely ripped. We definitely have to do surgery. It's going to be three grand. I guess we'll do an x-ray to confirm, which is not how that works. No, that's not how that works. Um, it's, so then the x-ray is going to be $500. And he didn't give us any other options. He, that was it. And then he let JD bring her back home. Didn't offer a brace for her, knowing that she had this problem. Just sent her home. It's not and that said, we'll, we'll schedule the x-ray for tomorrow if you tell us that you're ready to do that. Like, if it was a human, you would at least give them a brace, you know what I mean? Something. And you know you're going to make money off that, so you might as well make the money off that too, right? This is a $200 dog visit, by the way. Oh my god. This, this was like $215 for this dog visit. Insanity. Insanity. Um, so... As soon as I she gets home and he tells me this, I Google it, and they're like, no, you don't necessarily need to have surgery unless she ruptured it. Here's the signs that she ruptured it. They would be screaming, there would be swelling, there would be bruising. You know, like, they would That's be in some kind saying. of pain. She, she was she was limping, but she was not in pain. I felt all up and down her leg. Right. It was not swollen. There was no pain. She had no sensitivity. She lets you pull on her leg. Right. Um, so, unless, like... like she just has no way of feeling pain, which I know is not a thing. That's not true. Um, so we started looking it up and we we're like, okay, we'll buy a brace off Amazon. We'll get it shipped here. We got the next day it was too big because she's a weird shaped dog. <laughs> and, but we decided we're going to put her on basically essentially bed rest. Yeah. Um, which we're trying to limit her running around the house because even though she's only on three legs, she still runs faster than most she dogs. Does. Um, but we took out the doggy doors and we're walking her outside and like taking her into the grass because there's steps into our grass. Um, and even after doing that just for one day, even without the brace, because it hadn't come in yet. It's better. We saw improvement. Yeah. As you should. I mean, if you limit because, them and you but, take care of her, but then if you it should was, see. If it was ruptured, you wouldn't see because there's no way to improve something right. that has doesn't exist. Exactly. So she, it's probably a torn CCL. He's probably right, but it's not ruptured. <laughs> like, right. So there is a way to let it like heal because you, if you tear it, there right, you can heal a little bit and have build up scar tissue right. after like twelve weeks. So like we just have to let her be rest. Like we just have to calm her activity down, which is not easy because she's a pit bull. But she's like three legs. Whatever. I still got three. <laughs> not if you keep running around like that. But anyway, anyway, that's my story that vets suck. Which that vets never been. It's that vet sucks, not all. I mean, we've... I don't really think I've ever had a good experience with a vet. I've had an acceptable experience with vets. That's about it. I've had good experiences. We had a vet that... Well, I just really feel liked. like they, f they act like they... I don't know, there's a lot of vets that I feel like they got into it to not they don't give a shit about animals and i'm like why are you here why are you a vet yeah like this, this is not a money maker being a vet does not i mean it does make money make you loads but, of money it's not but like why is it an incentive like i don't want a vet that's there for the money right i don't want a doctor that's there for the money i don't want a doctor that went to school to become a doctor because he makes a bunch of money yeah. i don't want that doctor right i don't want that vet like i don't want that nurse like no <laughs> i want the one that wants there because they genuinely want to help and people like feel better about their existence Agreed. like heal them <sighs> Do this is my announcement better. that i'm gonna be a vet because everybody's doing it wrong. No, I'm just <laughs> the five minute google is a better we did the same thing whenever gd was going like told that he has to go through chemo five minutes of googling negated like half of the things the stupid oncologist said it's like this is modern research that you have not read. Like, are you kidding me? <laughs> your one job is to keep up to date on your field. 
True. But that's like me saying like, oh, I didn't learn about that new hard drive. Sorry, I guess we're not using it in this company. <laughs> like, I can't do that. <laughs> Don't and, you wish you And tried. people won't die if I make that decision sure. not to read that, you know what I mean? Like, ugh. Disgusting. Anyway, that's my rant of the week. It's, that suck. And they're overpriced. I, I just Vets are very it just felt so gross because it felt like he was trying to make money off of our dog's yeah, that's, injury, that's not right. and that's just gross. so disgusting and manipulative. Because I know somebody that just has the money would be like, "Yeah, here, just throw the money at it." Yeah, but like, well, and people that are are very invested in their animals, and they are, and yeah, I am you should too. Be. If you're gonna have an animal, it's a living being. But that's what's insane to me is that they know what they're doing. Because they know that you're invested in that animal. Yeah, like, it's just manipulation. And it's it just, is. It, like, even JD coming home and saying it felt gross the way he did it. Yeah. And, like, he didn't really take the time to investigate. Like, he had zero confidence whenever he brought her back home that the vet had made the right decision. And that to me just, like, if JD felt that way, would yeah. that be even... Because, like, I tend to not trust anybody right. anyway. That's kind of why I showed JD. I was like, here's all the information. Yeah. <laughs> you go do it. Um, also, I was working, but... Um, but yeah, the fact that even JD was like, I don't... I don't know about this. It's just shady. Yeah. But we'll probably be getting a new vet again. Again. <sighs> and you should. I mean, if you don't well, feel comfortable with your vet, get a new one. Even if you're in a small town, you can get a new vet. Always get a second opinion. Well, and that's what's so great about the internet nowadays. You don't have to blindly yeah. believe people because they're a professional you now. Yeah. Agreed. Although they don't really appreciate it whenever you go, but have you read this? <laughs> but they should. If you don't have a doctor that won't listen, that will not listen to you even though you've looked something up and won't entertain what you've looked up and say okay well let's talk about it and tell you why it wouldn't be good for you or or say oh okay well let's try it then you should find another doctor oh i've literally never spoken to a doctor that has been that, that really that has ever treated it they've always oh. I've, this is why I had a problem with dentists, too, because they've always been condescending. Yeah. They've always treated me like I'm a fucking moron. Right. And they've always acted like anything on the internet is false and not useful. Which I is have a very stupid. good neurologist that listens. And, you know, he'll tell me, yeah, I don't really necessarily, necessarily agree with that. But if you are having better results with that, go for it. You know, yeah. but he's always very, very, what am I trying to, the, like he listens oh. to what I have to say. What's he doing? What's he doing that way? And he's not one of those that just blindly do whatever, you know, it's, come, it's not the new, you know, if it's the new fad out right then, he's yeah. like, no. I don't think you should try this right now. Let's wait and see how it goes. Well, that's like when Jiu's been through chemo, he did a lot of research on different types because, like, he's not an 80-year-old man. He right. expects to live longer than a, right. a couple decades, you know? So, like, doing chemo, like, when he was 30 was a significantly right. bigger deal than if you were in your 80s. Exactly. Um, so he was like, I want to know what kind. I want to know, like, the lasting effects and, like, all of this and, like... Doctor is not accommodating in any way. He, he you saw, yeah, should research annoyed. everything, though. What? What's wrong? You should know what's going in your body and what your yeah. body is going to do or shouldn't do. Or You should have all the information. And if a doctor doesn't want to give you all the information, find a new one. Not all vets suck. What is your own vet? No. But all doctors do. <laughs> you don't like dogs. <laughs> at least a vet, it's like, generally, they probably like animals, and those are better people than people who don't like animals. If you don't like animals, you're already sus in my book. Zadie said no. <laughs> <laughs> he said no. Zadie? <laughs> no. 
don't think so. <laughs> you're like, I don't want to. No, Dad, you're wrong. You have to say the T word. And then give her one. Yep. 